COVID-19 is an infectious disease caused by a new strain of coronavirus called SARS-CoV-2. People can catch COVID-19 from others who have the virus. The disease spreads primarily from direct contact between persons through small droplets from the nose or mouth which are expelled when a person with COVID-19 coughs, sneezes, or talks. These droplets containing the virus can also land on objects and surfaces around the person such as tables, doorknobs, handrails, and cell phones. People can become infected by touching these objects or surfaces, then touching their eyes, nose, or mouth. Contact tracing means finding everyone who comes in close contact with a person with COVID-19. Contact tracing is an effective public health intervention to stop the spread of COVID-19. People in close contact with someone who has COVID-19 are at high risk of becoming infected themselves and of potentially further infecting others. By detecting cases and identifying close contacts, reporting them, isolating, and treating those who develop symptoms, public health aims to reduce infections in the population. Contact tracing involves three major steps. Step 1. Identify cases. Persons with COVID-19 or those who may have COVID-19 are identified. They are isolated, tested, and treated. Step 2. Identify close contacts and venues and settings. All persons considered to have close contact with a person with COVID-19 should be listed and profiled. These close contacts can be family members, friends, neighbors, or workmates. We ask the person with COVID-19 or someone who may have COVID-19 about his or her activities and social gatherings attended, the settings and places visited, and those who have been in close contact with him or her since two days before the onset of symptoms and within 14 days or until the person turns out negative on repeat tests. Step 3. Take immediate action. We immediately isolate suspect, probable, or confirmed cases in designated isolation centers for 14 days or until they turn out negative on repeat test. We monitor their condition and provide care as needed. We quarantine all close contacts without symptoms, ideally in community quarantine centers. We monitor their health condition and provide management and care as needed. Daily follow-up for 14 days should be conducted with all close contacts to monitor for signs and symptoms. Announce settings, places, and gatherings where the suspect and confirmed cases have been. Advise the public to avoid those places, settings, and venues. Advise those who were in the same event or place as a confirmed case to self-monitor and contact their local health authorities if signs and symptoms appear. Contacts and people who were in the same events or venues should also be provided with information about the disease and how they could avoid transmission to others. Contact tracing aims to detect, report, isolate, and treat cases quickly to prevent the spread of infection to others. Missing even just one case from close contacts will allow transmission of the disease to others resulting to more cases and lives lost. Contact tracing is an important public health intervention to effectively prevent large-scale community transmission. Let's stop COVID-19 transmission now. Detect, report, isolate, and treat. It is our most urgent action today.